That's truth. What are they? They, my little orange fur, are nanobots. And as a whole, they are known as Buster. Strength! Well, I've got what I came for. Time to move on. Not without a fight! I was thinking the same thing. Buster, take care of him. Ta-ta, Ty. Boss Cass is gonna love this. <laughs>
so Fluffy was tearing apart the oil rig looking for something. How strange. The thing she stole. What did it look like? Like a glowing cricket ball, but bright green. Sounds like a tennis ball. Tennis ball? Oh dear. That could be my bio-organic micro -scanalyzer. What's that? It's a machine that creates a holographic resonant image of the deoxyribonucleic constituent of any tissue sample. In English, mate? Who? Oh, uh, it maps out your genetic structure. It shows what you're made of using pretty pictures. Ah, why would Cass want that? I don't know. After all, it's useless without the power of a grid processor. Oh, my. What's wrong, Julius? I remember reading about a break-in at Currawong University last month, and the only thing stolen was a grid processor. I bet you top dollar Fluffy stole it. Boss Cass is up to something. Something big. You may be right, Shaza. I need to work out what Cass is doing with all those parts. Let me know how you go, Julius. In the meantime, I've got some bush rescue jobs to do. The bio-organic micro -scanalyzer. Julius has excelled himself yet again. Will you stop doing that? Let us begin the test. Well, what are you waiting for? Turn it on! The scanalyzer will extract the genetic information from the mammal specimen, then use the grid processor to calculate which attributes we want for our frail soldier. all the best qualities of a reptile and a mammal. Excellent! Now I can create an unstoppable army! I'm a genius. Mm, there are side effects, for the mammal that is. So cold. That's not a side effect, that's a feature. It'll make a great bullet point on the side of the box. thing we're lacking now is a large supply of unsuspecting mammals. <laughs> Don't worry about that, Carlos. I know exactly where we can find some. <laughs> okay, mate. Those lovable Hollywood stars Birrell and Squeaver are in trouble again. Only this time it's for real. Looks like Cass's hoons have dressed up as film extras and are trying to destroy their film set. Stop them. <laughs> 